everybody, it's me, Miss You, and we're working on 1.24, drawing number two. So I'm creating a new document. I'm naming it 1.24, drawing two, and I'm going OK. And I will let it think. OK, we're going to start off. I'm going to start off at the front view. It looks a little tricky, but you'll see how straightforward this drawing is. And here it is. I like to use the additive approach to drawing, but you could also use the subtractive approach for this one. Um, and I'm going to start off by sketching an L because to me, that is the main shape. When I look at this, that's what I see. And I'm not going to pay any attention to the size. I'm just going to do an overall general shape. And now I'm going to go around dimensioning it. And you could see from the dimensions um, that the top view over here is one. Let me go one. Okay, the, this is three. This is three. This is one. And we are all set. Okay, I'm going to go check for sketch. And let's see how wide we have to extrude it. I think it's each one is 0.75. It's a total of 1.5. So I'm now going to select the shape. I'm going to extrude it, and it is a total of 1.5. Okay, and I'm going to go check. And let's take a look to make sure we like how it looks. So that is the basis of what I'm working with. And now we're going to do um, another sketch. I'm going to do it on this face. I'm going to go sketch. It's a rectangle. I'm going to start it in, whoops. I'm going to start in that corner and something like, it's kind of something like that. Oh, I got it perfect. I got my dimensions perfect, but I'm going to go to the front view so I could, whoops. I want the right view actually. So I could see it nicely. And that looks like it's right, but I'm going to just verify the dimensions. So I'm going to go to dimensions. This is two. And I'm going to go enter. And it's light gray because it was already dimensioned. And this is 0.75. And that's also light gray. I don't know if you see it. There it is. Um, because it was already correct when I put it down. So I'm going to check it. I'm going to select it, and now I'm going to extrude it one inch. So here I am. So it's going to come out one inch. And let's look at the isometric view, and that we'll see. And that looks great. The next step we're going to create is another square. I'm going to draw on this over here, there's many different ways you could do this. This is how I'm choosing to do it. I'm going to sketch. Oops, it didn't. Here I am. I'm going to do the rectangle. I'm going to start the rectangle right in the corner. Okay, so it lines up nicely. And I'm going to try to get to one. There, I got to one. I'm going to go enter. And um, I believe it's already dimensioned, but just I always like to check. Um, so I'm going to go dimension, one side, one inch. Yes, it was already dimensioned to one inch. Tells me that I don't have to do it because it was already done. That's 0.75. Great. I'm going to end that sketch. I'm now going to extrude it. I'm going to look at the isometric. I think it goes out one inch. Let's go to the extrusion. Goes out one inch, perfect, check, and my part is done.